Can you tell me about, you know, obviously you had the pleasure to, to coach Steven a year ago, and then you also get the pleasure to coach him this year as well. Uh, what kind of progress you feel like he's made from, from last year to this year going up in weight class? Yeah, um, you know, Steven was at 113 last year and was a state champion. Uh, once, once he was able to get down to 113, he really didn't have any trouble. Uh, he knocked off uh, the, the best guys at that weight and then just ran through everybody at the state tournament, even uh, pinning the guy in the first period in the finals. Uh, so, you know, coming back this year, uh, he has a big target on his back being a state champion. Uh, everybody's, everybody's gunning for him. But he's also up at, at 126, which is just really tough. You know, at, at 106, 113, uh, and even 120, you know, a lot of times those guys are going to be younger guys, freshmen, sophomores, uh, guys that aren't really quite developed yet, doesn't have a lot of strength. But once you start getting up into 126, 132, 138, you know, that, that is just the really the toughest part of the, of the lineup. That's, you know, that's typically where the studs are. That's where the guys are that have technique and experience and strength and speed. And so he, he's up there in, in that weight class now, and he's getting to experience that. And so, you know, his record may not be uh, what it was last year. He may not feel that he's uh, as successful or that he's as good this year as he is last year, but he's way better. Obviously, uh, had a big year, lots of, very successful a year ago. Um, what made that special to you? Um, I don't know. I just really enjoy wrestling, and it was a great accomplishment, especially coming off a not-so-great season my freshman year. And um, it just felt really good to win. Um, what do you what do you feel like the difference is going up in weight class this year uh, versus you know a year ago when you when you really were ultra successful against some of those guys uh, as far as just how you're able to compete against those guys those bigger guys? Um, yeah, I'm wrestling some bigger kids this year, and a lot of them they know some more technique than me, and so I have to compensate that with just effort and. Um, like the world to want to win, whereas last year the kids they weren't really that good technically, or they weren't bigger than their size, and so it was a lot easier last year. Also, what what do you feel like technique-wise? You feel like he's made big strides technique-wise, even last year when you know maybe he wasn't pushed quite as much. Um, I definitely see him improving on his feet. Uh, you know, last year he got away with with quite a bit, uh, but. Again, up there at 126, up there in those middle weight classes, it's really tough. Those guys can shoot, those guys can defend their shots, and he's starting to really get some confidence with his takedowns. I think the biggest focus we've had is, is learning how to transition and finish a shot. Uh, he does very good at getting in, but then there's typically been a hesitation, and that's, that's one thing we've been focusing on is eliminating that hesitation, uh, taking a shot and immediately looking to finish it, and then defense defensively as well. I think that's probably his biggest area of growth is, is takedown defense. That's one thing that we've really been working on. And again, we've started to, to see some improvement there.